A 50-year-old male with acute right hemianopsia following coronary artery angioplasty and stenting. Non-contrast CT demonstrates loss of gray white matter junction in the left occipital lobe with associated mass effect compiled with acute infarct. CT examination non-contrast one day later after treatment with intraarterial TPA demonstrates increased mass effect in the left occipital lobe with associated hyperdensity. T2 weighted images MRI examination of same patient demonstrate left occipital lobe cortical gray and subcortical white matter hyperintensity with associated mass effect and effacement of the left occipital horn of the lateral ventricle. T1 weighted image demonstrates mildly hypointense gray white matter in the left occipital lobe. Diffusion weighted images demonstrate restricted diffusion in the left occipital lobe. Gradient echo or T2 star images demonstrate susceptibility artifact of the cortical gray matter greater than subcortical white matter of the left occipital lobe. CT and MR findings are consistent with hemorrhagic left occipital cerebral infarct.